Hello everyone! Welcome back for another time today at uh, Kings Island for Winterfest. My daughter and I are on our way. My daughter's actually asleep right behind me, right over there. So she and I are going to go check out Kings Island. Now this is her very first time going to Kings Island at all. And it is also her first time going to Winterfest. And then we also got a hotel tonight, so we will be checking out the Comfort Inn and Suites. So that'll be another video coming to you very soon. Uh, so definitely keep your eyes open for that. Today is a Monday, um, so we'll be there between Monday and Tuesday because this is actually Christmas break now. Now, I'm gonna try to get this video out to you as fast as possible, along with coming soon a YouTube Rewind um, of the Not Your Normal Guy channel and what all we have done this year. So today we're going to find out as much as we possibly can about Winterfest with kids. We're going to see some shows, we're going to ride some rides, and uh, we're going to do some tips and tricks along the way. So I hope you're ready and I hope you're excited. Let's go! Right there's Kings Island. Those those peaks right there, Those are, that's Kings Island. All right, we pulled up right at about 535. But we missed the light show. Yeah, we missed the light show. And so I'm all bundled up. <laughs> yep. We all we got nice and bundled up on and our way in. And uh, we're on our way up right now, but yeah, like I said, we missed the light show. I, it happened I right as we were pulling up. Um, yeah, I guess you did say that, didn't you? Yeah. Sorry. I need to give credit where credit is due. We are uh, on our way up into the park right now though. Um, you don't think that looks like the Eiffel Tower? No. It, it's it's supposed yeah, it's to look tower. like the Eiffel Tower. So 20 minutes later we're here because of course it went through Cedar Point system and uh, it's difficult to get Cedar Point system to work especially when it comes to Kings Island. What do you think of the way it looks? F-O-M? Oh, fun. Yes. F U N. Oh. <laughs> oh, you <laughs> now, luckily, we are here not looking for the thrills, so we're not going to be riding the big coasters tonight. We are going we're to be riding the kids, the kids stuff. One of those things Whoa, is the carousel right in front of me right now. Yes! Are you super tiny or is it super huge? I'm super tiny! <laughs> so we're gonna hit this and then go straight to Peanuts Guide to Christmas, which usually doesn't have very many showings. Um, so I would recommend doing that. But this one is 6.30, 7.30 and 9.30 this, this tonight. Um, so it's nice that they have more showings than usual. Um, a lot of the shows do end or they semi end around um, 8.30 because of the parade. So I'm sure that's why they don't have an 8.30 showing and then they have another 9.30 tonight. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> Seventeen minutes and our first ride's down. Now we are headed off to Charlie Brown. And we're here at the Kings Island Theater for a Charlie Brown Christmas. Get back home and wait for Snoopy. Get back. But I don't know anything about direct. 
Okay, what'd you think? Good, I wish you guys were there to see it. Well, <laughs> you guys can come over here to see it if you want to. Smile! Smile, one, say, chocolate chip! <laughs> <laughs> So I'm thinking this is going to be at least two rotations, but that's okay. We'll be fine. Uh, so we're going to have some fun. Let's go. Are you excited? It's been 20 minutes and we'll be getting on this ride uh, right now. Um, and then we're going to be heading off to our next attraction, which I think will be the possibly the Zephyr. Uh, we'll see what, what she wants to do. We're on the scrambler right now. We're ready to go. No, this one. Right here. That's the swings, yep. I will do it just for you, okay? I am not a fan of the swings, but for this one, I will do it. You may not see me do it. Not for any of the rest of y'all, but for this one, I will. <laughs> Smile. Ready to go. We're here. I hate this ride. Well, that was enough to where now we are frozen, right? Please leave a comment on this video right now. Um, tell me what else you want to see this year. I'll be back one more time yet this year. So let me know what you think. Um, also, have I missed anything? I'd love to hear um, if there's anything I missed or what the what the thing is that you think I would love the most this next year is going to be. I have a few ideas, but I've never been here during the year, so. It seems to be busier here than I thought it might be. I thought since it's not on a weekend, um, that it actually might be somewhat less than usual, but that does not seem to be the case tonight <laughs> here at Winterfest. Okay, so we have a problem because Kings Island was cashless, which is fine, but I left my debit card here the last time that I was here. I have no idea where, but somewhere along the way, it was gone. Right now, I have a ton of cash, but I can't use any of it. We're gonna fix this. Right now, we're looking for a warm place and we were gonna go to the buffet, that didn't work out. So instead, we're coming down here to the What the Dickens show, and we're gonna check that out. It's inside, nice and warm. We're only a couple minutes late to it. So they shouldn't even really be started yet. Christmas is a pleasant time, as a kind, giving, charitable time. And while it's never put the scrap of gold in my pocket, I say God bless it. I go. What did you think of that? It was good. Oh, look, it's Snoopy. Do you want to see Snoopy? Okay. We're going to have to stand in line. Merry Christmas, Snoopy. <laughs> All right, so we're going to an indoor attraction. It is a no-go on Boo Blasters. That is not allowable. Kids driving ride? Okay. <laughs> All right, we're gonna hit the driving ride. All right, so they actually keep that moving pretty well. They 
bring in three kids at a time and then they move them forward toward the front, let them out, and then put three more kids in, bring the three that they just let go, go, which they're leaving right now. And then they release the other three that had already made the circuit and then they uh, put in another, another three. Um, so the line is constantly moving. You don't have to wait for all six kids to be let in and let out all at one time. I like, I like the method. It's good. <laughs> How was it? Was it fun? Your fingers are numb. Yeah. Now the parade starts in three minutes, but shh, they don't know that I know this trick. It'll start back at Flight of Cheer. It will not reach up toward the front of the park until, you know, 10 minutes later at the, at the very most. Was that fun? I, how come that the other people got to go another turn, but I didn't? No, they didn't. They, they went a second, or they went, they had to get out, and then new people got in. They got in fast. We are just looking for some heat at this point. So, we are about to head in to the Spielzig house. I think that's how I say it. I don't know. We are in here just getting warm, chilling. And wiggling the tooth. And wiggling the tooth, yep. It has been very cold. I'm not sure that this is your favorite thing. What do you think? Next time, I think we better go here in the summer. <laughs> Winterfest isn't your bag, huh? No. <laughs> So she does not care at all about the parade, but she does care about riding the this thing. Oh, it's closed? Oh, well, I guess it's not something we can do because it's closed. Do you want to go into the snow globe? Yeah. Right there? I can take a picture of you. I'm not sure. All right. Good job. So apparently it's too icy for the snow globe right now. Um, I think I heard someone fell uh, from one of the workers there. Um, and they don't want to risk it that someone else might fall and get hurt. So so they got rid of it uh, for tonight. Daddy? Yeah, you want to take a picture? Yeah. Yep. All right. All right, you ready to go? <laughs> you make a good snowman. All right. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> okay, so they just send off the parade quickly over here. Look, we'll see Santa. So it looks like the parade route goes exactly back right where it came from. There are lots of booths and games all over um, that you can play. But right now we are headed off to Sounds of the Nativity. Sounds of the Nativity has music going on, live, live entertainment music going on all the way from the beginning of the evening until 9.30. Uh, so we only have so long to be able to watch people actually singing in it. What? There are. There are animals that are real. See him? He did a great life. 
And the angel of the Lord stood before them, and the glory of the Lord shone all around them, and they were greatly afraid. And the angel said unto them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you to the Lord. He's looking for food from you. Now, they will take cash here. We're actually able to feed the animals here, uh, which is really fun. She's had a lot of fun with this. Yep. Including the camel, too. <laughs> They're very soft. for you <laughs> you gotta let them lick it lick your lick your finger they are crazy <laughs> a nice little goat. Here you go, donkey. You want some food? There you go. I'm supposed to go feed the camel. This is our last mission of the day. Can you find Charlie Brown's Christmas tree for me? You found it? <laughs> there it is. <laughs> My daughter just said, why is that creepy thing up? And I'm like, yeah, I agree. Why is that creepy thing up? I am not a fan. <laughs> I don't trust it. It really does look like the Eiffel Tower. Yeah. We are going to be a couple minutes late for the Charlie Brown show. I'm not sure if they'll let us in or not. But if they don't, then we'll go over to Tinker's Toys. What? It does smell like food, doesn't it? And then we will leave for the night. It's been a long night. Some of this hasn't been that enjoyable, especially not for my little one, which surprises me, but sometimes that happens. But we did find the thing that was her favorite right there at the very end. I don't see any doors open, so I'm going to say it's not open. So instead, to Tinker's Toys we go. No, that's not it. <laughs> Are you clicking your heels? <laughs> I can do that. Looks like the show is going on.
What song is this from? Cinderella. Who is rude? Uh -huh. I Rudolph. have no idea. Rudolph. Rudolph. No way. <laughs> yeah. She says this is Tinker. It's been a great day here at Winterfest, um, like it always is. But there were a few moments when. Uh, at least my little my little one wasn't loving it necessarily. I think we found some things at the end. I think the cold is the real clincher. So what do you think of Winterfest altogether? Didn't like the snow. Didn't like the cold. Didn't like the cold? It could snow. It could literally snow. It did snow, but not real snow. snow. It was fake snow. They always have fake snow here. But yeah, the cold was not so much. So. So I suggest that if you have sensitive kids like me, I suggest you go not at this time of year. Yeah. Because it's not the best time at winter time. Or at least bring really, really warm gloves. We had gloves. Oh, she had a. She had gloves. She had a scarf, and a hat, and then this before, and then her, her hood also. Um, so it's not like we came unprepared, but maybe even warmer than this would be needed. There were several times that she said um, her fingers were frozen. They're so numb they hurt. So if that is the case, um, and a lot of kids have the same kind of reaction, you may need warmer gloves because that was the biggest complaint that I heard tonight. So. Um, but we, we went back inside a couple times and tried to warm up as much as we could so and wiggle wiggle the tooth the famous tooth <laughs> So thank you guys for joining us tonight um, Just click that subscribe button. Say that again? Just click that subscribe button <laughs> That's right. Also press that like button and uh, leave me a comment down below I'd love to hear from you guys and I read every comment you guys have a great day. Let's go.